one of the things that was so exciting for us about getting to launch a national tour and then also simultaneously getting to create a book um, is that it can reach, as you said, so many more people. That was, you know, what we wanted to do with the show in the first place. And now that we're getting this opportunity to sort of spread the story in, in different mediums and, and in different ways is, is really, really thrilling. Have you ever felt like nobody was there? Seeing that desire to engage with the characters, um, you know, that's how we knew that, okay, we could do a novel and there's, there's an audience there for it, and the tour, there's an audience there for that. It is about just getting the story in, in front of as many people as possible um, in hopes that it does make a difference or it starts a conversation with their family or, um, and that could be a kid at a library or it could be a family coming to see the show on tour and, and experiencing that way, which they couldn't come to New York and see or something. There are definitely shows that I feel like, for me, I um, needed as a kid, you know? I remember a rent poster on my uh, English teacher's wall and like just seeing LGBT representation for the first time when I was like an awkward eighth grader. Like I was like, oh my God, there's someone who's like me on a wall and I can talk about that. And, and uh, get, getting to hear that response from other people it, it is fantastic. We love that the show and that the story, uh, it's become a conversation starter between parents mm -hmm. and kids. Right. It can be a, a vehicle to begin to engage and have really kind of difficult conversations by seeing a story that, um, that is similar to your own and to be able to have that kind of cathartic uh, communication with each other is, is, has always been the goal.